this one is an easy to medium difficulty problem solving question. This question tests the concepts of tossing of coins, right? It's a permutation combination question. A fair coin is tossed n times. They have not said how many times has it been tossed. Here, the number of outcomes in which two heads will appear is 28. What is the value of n? How many times did we toss it is what the question is. If you toss a coin n times, then we will get r heads in ncr outcomes. Right? This is a concept that you need to know to be able to solve this question. So, tossing this coin n times, we know that the number of outcomes in which we have two heads. So, r is equal to 2 in our case. So, number of outcomes in which you will get two heads when a coin is tossed n times is nc2. The question mentions that this nc2 is equal to a 28. What is nc2? nc2 is n times n minus 1 upon 2. This is equal to 28. Cross multiply, what we have is n times n minus 1 is equal to f56. Do not expand it and do it, try and solving it as a quadratic equation. Basically, look at, you have a number, 1 less than that, the product of these two is equal to 56. That number is a natural number, is a positive integer. 8 times 7 is a 56. So, n is equal to 8. So, how many times did we toss the coin? We tossed the coin 8 times. Choice D is the correct answer to this. Got a bonus question for you for this. Take a look at that. Slight modification to it. A fair coin is tossed n times. Yes, we are still finding out the value of n. If the number of outcomes in which at least one head appears is 63, at least one head appearing, the number of outcomes is 63. What is the value of n is what the question is. These are the answer options for it. Solve this question and post your answers to the comment section of this video. Best wishes.